Hi, this is Josh Matthews of the Village News Sports Post Game Report. I'm here with James River head coach Greg DeFrancesco. River had a good game tonight, winning the Cole Bowl for the second straight year. Uh, Greg, talk about your team's performance, especially on defense. Well, obviously we we uh, we started the game strong defensively with the, with a defensive score and and pitched the shutout. So we played well all year, I think, defensively. Uh, our guys have uh, played tough, flying around. We're very very pleased and happy with them tonight. Talk about Q uh, Chung and his play. Um, seems to be a very dynamic player. You guys kind of have different looks at quarterback. But talk about um, the game he plays and uh, how he has been so far. Yeah, you know we're blessed. We, I mean, we really have we really have three good quarterbacks to go. Garrett Lucas, who played there at the end, number nine, started six games for us last year with Q at tailback while Cameron Green was recovering from a broken leg. And now, you know, we've got Q running some of the, uh, the option stuff and the zone read stuff for us, which gives us a weapon. Cameron comes in, has the things he can do, and Garrett can come in and manage the offense too. So we're very fortunate when we do that, we can move Q to some different places and, uh, and, and he can be a weapon anywhere, in the backfield, running at tailback, get him out in the slot, and run down the field. I think he had catches tonight. I think he had carries. He had throws for completions. And, uh, you know, we want to be able to, to have that multiple threat with him and use all of our weapons. Right, and two touchdowns on the ground and one through the air. Um, James over two and three this year. Uh, the guys said they feel like they really should have been able to win every game. What's the key to this team getting over the hump? Well, you know, what we've... Uh, we just got to stick together. We got to continue to battle. Uh, you know, we lost uh, two uh, two heartbreakers in the fourth quarter uh, over at Freeman. Uh, we had a final drive loss in 2013, and uh, on fourth down at the end of the game, we were stopped on the two yard line. Uh, we took a seven nothing lead into the fourth quarter against Monacan and had two long snaps sail over a punter's head in our own territory, gave him short fields, and lost 14-7. So we'd love to have those back. We can't get them back. We went down to Bird, played hard, uh, had a 65-yard, 11-play drive to start the game. I, I don't know that too many people do that against them, so it shows our capability. But then we struggled some after that, and they just wore us down with their size and athleticism. So, uh, you know, we just keep, need to keep plugging. We need to keep winning football games and keep building confidence. Great. Well, uh, this has been the Village News Sports Post Game Interview with James River Head Coach Greg DeFrancesco.